How would your life transform if you had the right tools to break free from poverty once and for all? Welcome back to Empower and Thrive. Poverty isn't just about financial hardship. It also involves limited access to essential resources like education, healthcare, and stable housing. These barriers can create a cycle that's tough to break, making it hard to see a way out. In today's video, I'll explore effective strategies to address these challenges and offer practical steps for improving your situation. Join me as I share some of the most effective strategies I've personally found to help break free from poverty and create a brighter future. Let's get started. Number one, financial education. Financial education is one of the best tools for eliminating poverty. Education is often said to be the key to success and for good reason. It's essential for fighting poverty. Most schools don't provide a strong foundation in financial literacy, so you'll need to learn it elsewhere. It is a piranha tank out there with financial gurus, so make sure you only use credible sources and don't buy into anything. Don't pay for any social media courses at all, none. Back to my point, learn about and understand financial products, financial markets, personal finance, credit scores, financial statements, etc. Many reputable companies offer this type of information for free. I will put a few links in the description. Always use credible sources and don't pay out of pocket. Once you gain this knowledge, you will be able to spot the scammers easier. With this knowledge, you'll be able to identify frauds that could ruin your financial well-being. No one can take advantage, or at least it is harder to take advantage of you, if you understand how things work, which is why education is so empowering. Arm yourself with knowledge, because it will be your best defense. 2. Develop marketable skills. Poverty is deeply connected to a lack of marketable skills. Learning a relevant skill is one of the best strategies for escaping poverty. Acquire a skill that people are willing to pay for. Figure out what you love doing or what you are good at and find a way to capitalize on that for yourself. Don't let anyone charge you money to tell you what they think you should be doing to make money. Focus on skills that you can capitalize on or knowledge that you have that others don't. If it's not entirely marketable, maybe think of a way to do instructional videos, write books, etc. With the right game plan, you may earn a decent living or at least boost your confidence and feel proud of how far you've come. 3. Learn to sell. Sales are fundamental to success in the world. The fact that the New York Times ranks books based on best-selling status rather than literary quality should make you think. If you master the skill of selling, you'll have the potential to earn a lot of money. Sales itself can be a career, but also you need to be able to sell your skills, talents, knowledge, etc. Whether this is for your own business or in a job interview, if you can sell, it can open up doors for you. It is incredibly awkward at first, but don't give up. The more you practice, the better you will get. If it's not too far outside your comfort zone, Go to networking events, neighborhood gatherings, social events, etc. Just get used to giving your elevator speech and have some details in mind in case you get asked questions. 4. Be mindful of how you come across to others. Our opinions and ideas are often shaped by the environment around us, including what we hear from peers, social media, and other influences. However, these influences don't always apply to every situation. It's important to develop the skill of knowing when and how to share your thoughts. Sometimes, even well-meaning ideas can come across the wrong way, potentially damaging relationships, opportunities in business or work, and possibly impact your finances. By taking control of your thoughts and being mindful of what you say, you'll not only protect your personal and professional relationships, but your bank account will likely benefit too. 5. Start where you are. In today's world, nothing comes easily. The educational system hasn't kept pace with society and higher education is no longer guaranteed to secure a good job. 
Don't let the fact that you come from poverty or have faced adversity stop you from even starting. Start with the best job you can find, even an entry-level position or a job that may seem below you. Start, literally just start, and build your foundation from there. The world is competitive and you need to have the drive to succeed. If you don't start, you won't be heading anywhere. 6. Community Resources Community resources are invaluable sources of knowledge and opportunity. Local organizations such as churches, public libraries, nonprofits, and community centers offer essential support that can help elevate your situation. Take full advantage of what they provide, whether it's training workshops, financial literacy programs, food banks, or networking events. Never underestimate the value of these programs as they can save you money and open doors to new possibilities. Many community outreach initiatives also offer scholarships, job placements, and skill development opportunities, helping you build networks, gain recognition, and advance your journey. These resources are here for a reason. Don't let them pass you by. Final thought, become the success story that you wanna see. The last point isn't really a point, but more of a guardrail. Don't become a hater. Successful people aren't your adversaries, and just as importantly, never look down on those who are still struggling to make their way out of poverty. Everyone has their own journey, and will make that journey on their own time. True progress comes from maintaining a success-oriented mindset while keeping your humility intact. Focus on your own growth, but stay grounded. Remember, escaping a tough situation is always worth the effort, and even the smallest steps can lead to profound changes. With perseverance and a positive outlook, you can become the success story you would want to see. Escaping poverty isn't easy, but it's absolutely possible with the right knowledge and tools. Remember, success happens one small step at a time. You've got this. Until next time, keep thriving.